This is an Arizona's Family News Update. Good morning, I'm Kyla Cruz from the Arizona's Family Newsroom. The latest coronavirus numbers from the state are a little better compared to the last few days in Arizona. Still, more than 3,200 cases were reported and 10 new deaths. Our weekly positivity rate stands right now at 13%. University of Arizona researchers are now asking the Arizona Department of Health Services to take action now before we get into a crisis situation with a surge in COVID cases. A letter was sent to the Arizona Health Department on Friday and calls for three things, a three week stay at home shutdown, a statewide mask mandate and providing financial aid to small businesses and families during that time to prevent evictions and foreclosures. The University of Arizona COVID modeling team says if this doesn't happen, consequences for our state will be grave. While some agree this is a good idea, others say it goes too far. President Trump's legal team will be here in Arizona tomorrow. They've scheduled a public hearing with some members of the Arizona House and Senate. Apparently, the team will be gathering and examining any evidence of election fraud. Arizona election officials have already said there is no such evidence. The president's attorneys, uh, that's Jetta Illis and uh, Rudy Giuliani, are expected to be at the meeting. Top lawmakers say this is not an official legislative event. The Times of London reports that Joe Biden may be looking at Cindy McCain to serve as ambassador to the UK. Cindy and her late husband, Senator John McCain, are longtime friends of the Bidens. The Republican has been making headlines for crossing party lines to help the Biden campaign. She appeared in Biden ads and said his presidency would unify the country. But right now, no confirmation on the possibility of that appointment. Meteorologist Kim Quintero here. Sunny skies today, a beautiful high of 74. Tonight, we dip to a low of 49 degrees, partly to mostly sunny and breezy for Monday with a high of 73. We stay in the 70s through Wednesday. Our coolest days of the week, Thursday and Friday, with highs in the upper 60s. No rain expected for the next seven days. For updates on more stories, download the Arizona's Family News app and check out our app on your Roku device. I'm Kylie. Have a great Sunday.